Today I'm going through how to set up a podcast on Podbean and uh, upload files to get started. So I'm just going to do a Podbean free account for today, but um, they have a bunch of different accounts you can see under pricing. And one of the cool new things they added just in the last couple months are unlimited plans. But today we'll go with uh, one of the free plans. So we're going to... Um, make a username here and think about what you want your username to be. You can set your own domain later, but it causes some issues if you uh, don't like that uh, name. You want to keep that consistent, so think of something that goes with your brand and um, domain that you have. And I'll type in my email address here. Password. And go down here and do the little captcha and create an account. You can also, as you can see, sign up instantly with Facebook if you want to choose that route. So uh, you have that option. And here's where you would uh, go and choose podcasts that you want to follow and that kind of thing in your account. And we'll just um, not deal with that right now today. We're going to go to publish a podcast to show it. So I went to that publish uh, uh, tab, and that's what brought me to this. This is the dashboard, and there's all kinds of things here on your dashboard, which uh, maybe I'll go over at a later date. But real quick, I'll look at the settings, because that's kind of important um, for your site. And so these are just some general things. There's all kinds of customizable options and, and that kind of stuff. But you probably do want to put your own logo. This is just the Podbean logo. So you can upload your own um, logo there. Um, you'll want to make your channel title, uh, whatever you want that to be. So for instance, we can do uh, happy podcasting here to go along with everything. And then we can pick a category. So if we're arts, humor, career, that kind of thing. I'm just going to pick general for today. You can apply keywords, um, that kind of stuff, and um, change those settings around. So that's where you do that, and those are the things you probably want to do as you get started, of course. And today we're going to go into the basic important thing that you'll need, which is how to publish a podcast. I'm going to click on choose a file to upload right here, browse, and then you choose your file, which you've created, um, in this case, an MP3 for my podcast this week. This is just a sample I have, so I'll choose that there, and you can see it's uploading, and there it is. You can see the file name right here, and then you have the chance to uh, make your title for that particular um, episode there and put in whatever text and as you can see it is pretty a pretty simple type of editor that looks uh, very familiar for anybody that's used WordPress or Word documents or anything like that and so you can just go in and add whatever um, show notes or that kind of information that you want and use all the various buttons and formatting that you need there um, as well. And there's also some more advanced type of things you can do, which I'll probably not do any of that right now, but just talk about that at a later date in terms of being able to customize your URL as you want and make other changes um, that you might need. But we'll just do a real simple one today and we'll hit publish here at the bottom. And as you can see now, we have our, this is the original file that was just there, and then this is my sample that I uploaded today. And if you go to view site, it's not going to be anything very exciting since it's just a sample, but here is the episode that I just published with the file, the MP3 file that you can play. And if I had written more text or show notes, that would all be available right there. Uh, in this case, I just used the free uh, account under Podbean, but if you go to the pricing page, you can see all of the types of um, things that they offer, and one of the things they just added a couple months ago was unlimited bandwidth and storage for audio or video, so for those that do a lot of podcasting, that's really great because it keeps your costs at a fixed price that you know, so um, 
this is just a small file, so I could upload this under the free account, but if I get to anything bigger or start to uh, want to do more, then obviously I need to look at which pricing one makes sense for me for today. So um, that shows just how easy it is. That's how simple it is to get started uh, when you want to do a podcast. So easy to get, get, get going, and um, I'll probably do some other videos that show some of the different aspects of things that you can do and customizing and all of that uh, a bit later.